What is up, you guys? I'm Farah, and today we're reacting to episode four of season two of Jujutsu Kaisen. Last episode, my heart broke into a million pieces. Um, honestly, like I was shocked. I didn't even, I didn't, that kind of situation didn't even cross my mind. And although Toji is very sexy, um, I hate him. And a lot of you were really upset about how much I hate him. And then some of you were concerned that I find him attractive. I can find somebody attractive and still hate him. So he's a piece of shit. But we know that Gojo is definitely still alive because obviously he's in the future. So I'm kind of excited to see how he is alive or how he comes to be alive essentially or what he did. Um, but anyways, if you guys would like to see my timer or my full opacity reactions, make sure to go check them down below in the description to help support me and the channel. And without further ado, let's get into it. Kaido, Riko chan. <laughs> mm, okay. Have to watch this again. Phenomenal content. Oji, what the fuck, man? Kick his ass. The music is jazzy. Dun, 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 dun. How did that not face him at all? <sighs> I need a break. Wait, does Toji? Is Toji the one who's gonna corrupt him, like, fully? Mm. He's not there, is he? Okay. Does it? Unless he inhales it? Toji, that's so fucking gross. But he's so sexy. Oh, this is so difficult. I can hate you and love you as a character in the story and still find you attractive. He's talking about Gojo. Yeah, stop giving him a fucking bullshit. It increases the strength? Did he kill her too? Tochi, what the fuck? Ghetto's so cool, man. Wow. Holy crap. Okay, he's so cracked. He's so cracked. He's so cool, though. Riff Raff. He really said that was some bitch shit. Who? Is that a curse employed by Ghetto? <gasps> He's gonna absorb it? That'd be so smart. 
に差がある飛行物を省きほぼ無条件で取り込める能力は特殊だが呪霊自体は強い Wait, Gato, if you inhale that, does that turn you bad? <laughs> no, 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 no. What the fuck? Toji, that's way too much. What the fuck, Toji? <gasps> Megumi? What was that little weird pause all of a sudden? That was so odd. Is he like, like actively a cunt? Or does he not actually remember his child? Look at his face. Fucking gross people, man. Why? Okay. Is that why Ghetto only wants sorcerers alive? Is because of these fuckers? Because they're not sorcerers, right? That's the point. That's why Geto wants to crush non jitsu sorcerers. Yeah, they really don't care at all. They just want money. Literally. Psychos! Like, actually, psychos. Ew. Yeah, literally, literally. So they saved her. Okay. Is Rico actually like killed? Fair. I feel like you're probably gonna see him in hell, though. Yep, Toji, you're gonna get your ass fucked. Gojo! He finally was able to do it. He sounds so angry. Jesus. 
キョンパしなかった頭をぶっ刺すのにあのジグを使わなかったこと大変 Yeah, you're what you are. You are. What the fuck is happening with Gojo? What is he high on? Endorphins right now? The high of being alive? He's so cool. No, 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 he's so cracked, it's not even funny. He's just about to kill Megumi's dad and NBD. Wait till Megumi finds this shit out. He's floating? Gojo, what the fuck's- He's kind of scaring me, I won't lie. Like, I, I'm happy that he's alive, but also, like, he's freaking me out. Yeah, I don't think you've got this at all, Toji. Yeah, he can see everything. Toji are so fucked, Bobo. He can see everything in slow motion right now. He can see everything. Yeah, he's achieved, like, the limitlessness. It's kind of dark. It's also really disturbing. <laughs> he's, like, unmatched. Yeah. Yeah, they're like cousins. About what? About what? About what? <gasps> Purple? Oh, that's his like OP. Oh, you're fucked, Toji. Yeah. But you can't. Yeah, that's what he means. This is painful, actually. Megumi! He remembers Megumi! Toji. I know Toji's a bad person. And he's caused a lot of harm to people we love in this series, but I think he's a fantastic character. Like genuinely a phenomenal character. And I, I think honestly his evil is debatable, honestly. I feel like maybe he's deluded himself into forgetting his past in the pride of the Zenin clan because he was rejected because he had no curse energy at all, right? Just saying Maki was rejected too. Um, So when he saw Gojo, it was like the pride of like, he wants to have pride again. He wants the pride of being valuable to that clan. And if he defeated Gojo, you know, somebody like possibly the most like powerful jujitsu sorcerer of the modern age. If it, it, it would have felt like he would have redeemed himself. So it's like, I feel I can understand him, but I cannot excuse his actions. Does that make sense? I can understand, but I can't excuse. Oh, the worm goes to ghetto? <laughs> 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 
Who the fuck? <gasps> he brought her. He saw infinity. Oh, this is so fucked up. What the fuck? The people clapping are disgusting. I'm so fucking disturbed, but also like really like in awe. I think this is definitely the start of Ghetto's like decline into hatred of non-sorcerers because the people who caused Rico's death are the non-sorcerers in that guild. And I think they specifically stated that. I think, I think they did a very succinct job at specifically showing us that they're non-sorcerers to explain Ghetto's disdain for them. And also it's like seeing that Rika-chan so Rico Chan was like literally like sitting there like limp. Her body is limp. And these people are clapping with smiles on their faces is so fucking disgusting. I can't even imagine the disdain and like hatred towards these people in that moment. Gojo has like found infinity. Essentially, he's found purple infinity or like the combination of both red and blue, the two sides of him. And they've created this like ecstasy feeling this overcoming high and he's seeing infinity and i feel like that's a power that one human shouldn't have because it makes them lose their humanity they're infinite right they see infinity so when you see infinity a lot of things become pointless hence him not feeling anything in that moment but like i can't even imagine ghetto's pain when he was like there's no point now into killing all these people because rico is dead rico's dead and i think the ending part of the show saying like there are two parts two sides to every person ghetto's two sides and ghetto saying like there has to be meaning for this for especially for jujitsu sorcerers because they see such innate darkness and cursed people and cursed ways of thinking and behaviors that there has to be a reason otherwise there's no point there's no point it's just incredibly dark um but anyways please i ask that there are no spoilers in the comments and yeah if you guys enjoyed this video please leave a comment a like and subscribe and um yeah let's talk about our theories but no spoilers okay have a good night bye bye